Hey guys, I wanted to show you a quick, simple, and effective way to pull the error codes off of an Onan generator. Today, one of our groomers was out in the middle of the groom. The control panel started beeping and signaling that there was an error with the generator. What? So, now that she's gotten back, we're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna show you how to pull the error codes off of an Onan generator. This happens to be off of a uh, Wagon Tails Pet Pro, but regardless, if you're using an Onan generator, it should pretty much work for most all of them. There is a little trick to it, so here we go. We've got the cover off the generator, the manual on off switch. What you need to do is hit the stop or prime button three times within five seconds. You'll get a series of blinks here, it says that it's up and running. So now what you'll do, you get your three blinks and then a pause. You're gonna go ahead and hit the prime button one more time and you're gonna count the series of blinks that you get. This will be your error code. So for example, one, two, three and a pause. That's gonna be three is your first digit. The second series of blinks will be your second digit. So here we go, one, two, three, four, five, six. That would be error code number 36. So we'll go to the Onan website. We're gonna look at the Onan error code number 36 and see what that means. It did continue to run all day, so I'm hoping that's a good sign. When the light starts blinking, and let's say the first series of lights only blinks once. So you're gonna be your number one. Uh, if it blinks from one to nine times on the second series of blinks, then you can calculate if it's gonna be 11, 12, 13, so on. If it blinks twice and then one through nine, it'll be 21, 22, and so on. If it blinks three on the first series and then one through nine on the second series, it'll be 31 through 39. Okay, so now once we've done all the sequence, we know our codes, we know what we're looking for, we need to reset the generator. To reset it, what you're gonna do is hit the prime button twice. And that's it. Yeah! That's not gonna fix the problem, but it will erase the code for the time being and then run it again if it pulls another code go through the same cycle. Hopefully it'll give you a good starting point on where to look for a fix for your generator. I know for us, it's crucial that we have our generators up and running. I know for all of you it is, it's our livelihood. So if we can possibly fix these ourselves or at least know where to start, it can save us a lot of money and time. Hopefully this helps you guys. If you have any additional tips or tricks or hints, please, Put them in the comments below, let me know. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and next time something happens, I'll go ahead and record it for you guys. Hopefully we can find a, a resolution to some of these problems and I'll help you guys out. I'll see you next time.